We have arrived at Carolina Landing RV Resort in Fair Play, South Carolina. Let's go check the place out. Check out our latest RV and camping related gear at our Amazon storefront. Link in video description. When you first arrive, you're going to pull over to where the sign is and go in and register. After you're done checking in, you're going to come up to the gate, punch in your key code, and off you go to your site. If you have kids, or even grandkids, they have a nice playground here for them to enjoy. We had great cell service on all three carriers during our stay. Lou will provide you with the upload and download speeds in the written description. If you want to play a round of golf, you can find the putters here as well as the balls. Lou and I did play a round of mini golf. Here are a few pictures. This hole is an uphill challenge. Hole number four. Ah, oh, not enough bump. During our stay, the pool was closed and they were also doing some upgrades on it. While doing laundry, I sat out on this nice swing. I did a video for you and Lou's going to cut to that now. Okay, so there's the swing and right here's the entrance to the laundry room. Melody did a video for you. I'm cutting that video right now. I'm in the laundry room this morning at the Thousand Trails Carolina Landing in Fair Play, South Carolina. They have four washers and four dryers. For wash, you are looking at 250 for light, 275 for medium, and three dollars for heavy. The machines take credit card, Visa. MasterCard, Discover, American Express. And the dryers are $2.25 a piece, and you get approximately 45 minutes of dry time, and they did a pretty good job. Just beyond the laundry and where the swing is located, you'll see our Cougar fifth wheel in the background right behind Melody. Uh, we're gonna come back and show you our site a little bit later in the video. Right now, we're gonna take you around and show you the campground. Carolina Landing RV Resort is an expansive campground. Uh, this building off to my left is the event center. It's a very large uh, complex inside. That, that The building is set aside for special events. The reason I walked you over here is just beyond that event center is the F section. Melody and I are camped in the A loop. Uh, our site was assigned, so uh, we, we received the site assignment and then proceeded directly to our site. We didn't have to go look around for a first come, first serve site. But uh, these first few sites in the F loop, you're looking at them in the middle of your screen. Um, it looks to me like they're seasonal sites, but just beyond here, is the heart of the F section, and I just walked through the other day, and there were some pretty nice sites down there, so I'm gonna take you down there first. Back up that way is the event center. This is the F section. Here's a vacant site right here. It looks like it's site 19. I would think this is a 50 amp site. You got water. Nice new box, yeah, 30, 50 amp electric service, folks. Good show. You can get your rig level on that site. And just down below that building there is the shower house and restroom facility. And the sites I looked at the other day were just, just down the road. So let's take a walk up there. So that last site we looked at was up in there. Here's the restroom and it says D on it. So maybe that's the D section up where we were just at. Um, but this is definitely the F section. See the F on the signpost off to the right? 
and there are some pretty sweet sites in here. There are two sites off to my right I want to show you here in Eflouf. Uh, the first is, uh, looks like site 38. 38 is off to my right. You have a 50 amp connection on a water spigot. You can get a big rig in there and you can get your rig level. That's one of my top picks for Eflouf. And then right next to it is site 39. You can get your rig level here. You also have the concrete pad. Here's your water connection. And uh, looks like you're also going to have a 30-50 amp electric hookup. Yep, 30-50 amp electric hookup. Cool beans. Right across from the A-loop, you'll find the rec center. Let me take you inside and show you what's in there. Here's the inside of the lodge area. You got some pool tables, a seating area here. You have a television set. On the other side of the rec area, you have another television set. The first day we came in, there were some uh, uh, parents and kids in here doing homework. Here's a look at some of the cabins in Carolina Landing RV Resort. Heading down this hill, we're going to visit the lake. These rentals look like uh, you can get two different rentals in one building, one cabin. You have two different doors. Uh, some of these have back decks, and they have separate a petition uh, set up in the back deck. You have extra parking here. That's your main parking right, right in the center of your screen. And then for this particular cabin, there's another auxiliary parking pad right there. I will say they're nice looking rental units and uh, you, there's a view of the, the screen porch area in the center of your screen there. And it's uh, quite a hoof going down this hill. They have cabins strewn all through here. And uh, this road is gonna take us down the hill to the lake. It is pretty back in this section. Take in some of the scenery. Lots of cabins. And they have a real nice dock area down at the lake. My brother has a pontoon. Hey Tony, I know a place where you can dock your pontoon. It is a pretty lake, folks. Be kind. I'm kind of liking that flag. My rig is right up at the top of this hill, off to the right. Yep, I'm right up here, off to the right. We've been really enjoying our time here at Carolina Landing RV Resort. There's my cougar. And I did get fairly level despite the pitch on the site. <sighs> Let me walk you around the front. We have a full hookup, 50 amp site. And uh, we're rather pleased with it. It's like the perfect fall evening here at Carolina Landing RV Resort. The moon is just above these pine trees over here. Check them out. Very peaceful tonight. Melody and Milo are out today. 
And Melody has a few things she wants to tell you about. We had an amazing time here during our stay at Carolina Landing. We did a day trip to Helen, Georgia, which is a cute little barbarian town. We will show you some pics, but you can also find the video on our YouTube channel. We met up with Donna, the manager, at her office. Her staffs checked up on us several times during our visit. We really enjoyed our site and our stay here at Carolina Landing RV Resort. And I think I'm going to leave it here. I'll have the upload and download speeds for Verizon, AT&T, and T-Mobile in the written video description on YouTube. As always, if y'all like these videos, like and subscribe, and I'll see you down the road.